This is the Commodity Scrap Metal Recycling and Economic Report by our Benley Roll-Off Trailers and Gondola Trailers August 1, 2022. U.S. weekly crude steel production rose to 1.754 million tons as the slowing U.S. economy is hurting demand. When the U.S. dollar index rises, commodity prices in dollars usually falls. It fell to 106.5 but remains near the 20-year high. The U.S. continues to raise interest rates, helping to support the higher dollar, but future interest rate hikes could be slower. WTI crude oil price rose to 98.62, down 4% for the month after an 8% down in June. This was on tight supplies, but concerns of an economic slowdown. OPEC is meeting this week. It is not clear if they will further increase production. The U.S. weekly oil rig count rose to 605 as the slow, very slow trend up continues to maximize shareholder returns. Oil companies are reporting record or near record profits for the second quarter. U.S. weekly oil production rose to 12.1 million barrels per day as there were also record U.S. exports of oil, that's exports, of 4.55 million barrels per day and still imports of 6.1 million barrels per day. The slow trend up continues to maintain tight supplies. Scrap steel number one HMS price was steady at $360 a gross ton. There is slight downward pressure on pricing this month. Hot roll coil steel price fell to $40.67 per hundred weight, which is $8.13 a ton on slowing demand and exports taking market share. Copper price rose to $3.59 a pound. New China stimulus is expected and on future supply concerns. Aluminum price also rose to $1.13 a pound, which is $24.97 a metric ton, down about 40% from the peak. This was on recession fears and as the Chinese have increased aluminum production. China July NBS Manufacturing Purchasing Manager Index fell to 49 with under 50 meaning contraction. This was with COVID lockdowns and new orders, exports and employment were all down. Related, China July home sales plunged 39.7% versus last July. U.S. Federal Reserve interest rates rose 0.75% to 2.25% to 2.5% but are still extremely low. The Federal Reserve is currently planning to 3 to 3.5% interest rates by the end of 2022. U.S. second quarter GDP, gross domestic product. It fell to a negative 0.9% the second quarter in a row decline means that that is the key definition of a recession. While the economy is clearly slowing, decent job growth continues. The negative GDP data was driven down by companies reducing inflated inventories. U.S. Personal Consumption Expenditure Index, the PCE, which is a key index the Federal Reserve follows. It rose to 6.8%, the highest in 40 years, Food was up 11.2%, energy was up 43.5%. Excluding both, called core PCE, it rose 4.8%. U.S. June new orders for U.S. made capital goods. They rose 1.9% for May, the fourth consecutive monthly increase. Transportation equipment led the increase. Wall Street's Dow Jones Industrial Average rose 946 points to 32,845 as U.S. negative GDP seems like it could cool the rate of interest rate hikes. Roll-off truck and roll-off trailer parts for sale at Benley. Galbraith, Galfab, Palfinger, American, Dragon, and more. Rollers, pulleys, shivs, pins, tarp arms, tarp motors, tie-downs, and more. Order online at Benley.com or call 734-722-8100. As always, feel free to call or email me with any questions, and we all hope all have a safe and profitable week.